What's up guys? Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make this gorgeous double layered anklet in just under a couple minutes. Let's get right into it. First, we're going to cut the chain using our cutter, which I'll be linking down below in the description. As you can see, when you cut the chain, you'll have some excess chain left over like this. So what I'm going to do is actually cut this excess chain link off. And the reason I do that is because the ending link is the one that the CZ is hanging off of. And it's much wider to fit a jump ring in versus this over here. In the event that you want to save all little pieces of the chain, what you can do is grab your owl tool, which I'll also be linking down below in the description for you to shop, and just insert it into the last link of the chain and twist until it's wide enough to where you can fit the jump ring inside. And it'll look something like this, which is a little bit wider, but in this case, I'm going to just go ahead and cut it off again. This link is going to be so much easier to work with. I went ahead and measured how I want the chain to sit on my leg. This is where I'm going to be cutting the chain. So grab your cutter and cut that second layer off and it should look something like this. Grab your jump rings, use your set of plier to open them up and attach both ends of the link onto the jump ring and on this side I'm going to go ahead and add my clasp and use your set of pliers to close the jump ring up pass it and then come back to where they meet on the opposite side of the chain we're going to go ahead and grab our jump ring open up with your set of pliers and attach both the chains onto the jump ring Use your set of pliers to close the jump ring up. Pass it and come back to where they meet. What I love so much about this is that you can use this technique to create just about anything you want, including this necklace that I have on right here. And you can even use it to create belly chains or body chains, a bracelet, or you can use this method by creating this same style with a different type of chain. If you have a more formal event and you're wearing your heels, you can totally pair it for something like this as well. If you haven't already subscribed to our channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on our weekly new jewelry and spill tutorials to help you get inspired on what you want to create next. All the products that I use in this video are going to be linked down below in the description so you can actually click the link and it'll redirect you to our website where you can shop that exact item to create this look. 